Hi everybody, welcome to beautiful Ithaca, New York. This is Caitlin Wakila, head field hockey coach at Ithaca College. Joining me today is my assistant coach Mo Ordnung and my graduate assistant coach Anna Bettino. So we are here to uh, provide the drill of the week and this week's um, drill is going to be the circle up drill inspired by our circle up groups. The goal of the circle up drill is to be used as a skill warm up. We perform this drill at the beginning of a practice and the goal is for our players to be up tempo, get some solid touches on the ball. Um, I would recommend that you split your team into groups of um, three to five per um, set of cones and we have five sets of cones. So we only have two demo ladies today. So we're gonna do our best to um, provide you with the best example of the circle up drill. The first skill set we're going to do in the circle up is going to be a one, two to the right. So I'm going to have Anna step up to the ball and um, she's got this amount of space. This is about five yards. I'm going to recommend that each set of cones you have is a different amount of yards. So Anna's going to start at the cone. She's going to go about halfway, perform a one, two to the right or a pull right. Good. And go ahead, go around the cone and dribble all the way back to the cone. One thing that I want to point out is on the way back, I recommend having your athletes really work on having the ball out in front and also using a change of speed. So we're going to try to try to do this at speed now. Go ahead. skill set at the green cones and we're going to perform what we term the Aus X otherwise known as the Australian X. So this is a great skill to execute when you're possessing the ball um, in the middle of the field and you don't have any options forward but you want to get the ball back and you have a teammate who's available. So I'm going to have Anna dribble up to the green cone. She's going to pause, take a look forward, realize she has no options, a nice step with your right foot back and she's going to release a three yard pass to me and then um, we'll just rotate. Go ahead. Good, take a look up. Okay, so we are at skill set four, which is going to be the use of 3D skill. I would recommend have your players get creative, um, really just kind of work with the ball in the air. It never matters to us how high um, our players do it. You could have your players carry the ball in the air, you know, a couple of yards um, or just little touches in the air. Um, we're, we're always kind of reminding our players to not just go in a straight line, really try to be dynamic with your touches. And then once we get to the cone, I'm gonna have um, both Anna and I really try to pick up our speed. So we've gone nice and slow, we're gonna take that turn around the, the cone and then we're gonna really work to get back for speed. Good. For our fifth and final skill set, we're gonna perform a spin move. And what we're gonna do in between um, cone A and cone B is we're gonna perform a one, two or a pull right um, and then once we get up to the cone, we're gonna take a, a look up, realize that we're, uh, we have pressure on us. We're gonna spin out and then release and make a pass back to the cone. So Anna's gonna perform uh, a one, two to the right. Good. She's gonna make her way up, take a look up, has nothing, make the pass back to me. That's it for our drill of the week. We hope you enjoy Circle Up and that you have the opportunity to make it your own.
Shout out to Circle Up group number one, first round draft picks. And shout out to Circle Seven, lucky number Circle Seven. <laughs>